Hello, hello, everybody, all, the, all of our Facebook people out there. My name is Sean Dale, and I am the director of the Zoom play, Fading Fast, a science fiction one-act play written exclusively for Zoom. We are very excited to do this, and it is uh, written by Colette Mazunik. Um, and so we just are very excited to bring you this show tonight. We had a great opening night last night, and we expect great things tonight and tomorrow night as well. So be sure to tell your friends after the show what you saw and experience this new form of theater with us. And so without further ado, I bring to you Fading Fast. Are you excited? We're excited to get to know you. Soon we'll be your window to the world. We can get started whenever you're ready. Whenever you're ready, just say, let's get started. Let's get started. Okay, first off, we'll just need permission to download your identity profile. Do we have your permission? To give us permission, just say yes or okay. Sure. That works too. One moment. Hi, Claire. Good to meet you. That was a nail biter last night, wasn't it? And then when he caught that interception. Go Broncos. Okay, we're ready to go. We'll be learning your preferences as we spend more time together. If you ever want to fine tune things along the way, just say my name and ask for the menu. Rose, menu. That was quick. Settings. Okay, just tell me what you'd like to do. Override perception settings. Are you sure you want to override perception settings? Yes. Warning. We strongly advise against this option. Give our algorithms a chance. If your quality of life, as measured by dopamine level, is not improved within 72 hours, we will refund your money, reprogram your classes, and give you a free trip to the Amazon rainforest. Do you still want to proceed? Yes. If you choose to tamper with our perception settings, you forfeit all warranties and guarantees, and we will not be held liable for any negative mental, emotional, physical, or spiritual side effects. If you tamper with our perception settings, you not only waive the right to sue us, you also cannot speak negatively about us in any forum, including online, in the media, in person, in therapy, or in confession. With that in mind, are you sure you would like to proceed? No, never mind. Good choice. Okay, so a quick reminder to be extra careful when moving in public for the next few days. For safety reasons, we cannot display a perception level of less than 2% while you are moving, but any change associated with a new pair of glasses might cause a bit of disorientation at first. Enjoy, and if you ever need me, just say my name. Thanks. Oh, and uh, uh, sorry about the whole overriding thing. <laughs> so, how are you loving them? Aren't you just loving them? I, I kind of feel guilty for liking them. No, you do not feel guilty. You love them. All right, uh, I kind of do. Of course you do. <laughs> it, it feels like cheating. I'm telling you, your blood pressure is going to go down. You're going to have so much more energy. I, I feel more angry. Of course you feel more angry, but... It's a productive anger. You can really do something about the things you care about. That's the brilliance of it. It focuses you. Oh, like, like the other day, there was this rescue furs event. You know they auction off used furs so new animals don't have to die? Well, anyway, I never would have thought. In trouble, throws and completes. 
takes it for a first down. Bottom of your screen. Play clock at three. Rivers in trouble. Rivers is wrapped up. Wow. And what did you do? Wow. And what did you do? <laughs> I threw paint right back at her. <laughs> <laughs> The air sets up a screen to back and back across the field. Breaking news. One of the seven hostages has escaped his brutal guards and has been safely transported back to his family and friends. To see a live cast replay of the heartwarming reunion between the freed hostage, his baby son, golden retriever that he nursed to health, and his wife who is dying of cancer, press on your earpiece. Just wow. Yeah, that was so. That was the most heartless thing I've ever seen. Really? To take away his job? Someone should start raising money so his mother doesn't have to leave that house. You know? I should do that. <laughs> Carly, uh, I want to start a fundraising drive. Oh, okay, well then I'll donate. Yes, the usual amount. They've already raised 7,000. Well, you see, that's what's so great about these. You can take action and, and you can see the generosity of people. I'm, uh, I, I think I'm having technical issues. I saw the live cast, but I didn't catch everything. One of the seven terrorists escaped. And so this guard who was supposed to be watching him had to tell his widowed mother that he's going to lose his job and it won't be able to pay the mortgage on the house that she's lived in since she was a baby. With the dog? The dog? Oh, uh, did his mother have a dog too? Did yours show the dog? Probably because you have a pet. They probably showed him because you have a pet. Is she going to lose her dog too? Oh, someone should adopt it. Y you, you could adopt it. Oh, no, no, I, I don't think Proust would like another dog. Well, someone will adopt it. Someone else who saw your feed. That's what's so great about these. They connect the need to the people who can help. Breaking news. One of the cruel guards is finally going to be dismissed in disgrace. Would you like to sign a petition to assure that neither he nor any of his family members get a penny of his taxpayer funded pension? If you'd like to sign a petition, cut your earpiece. Huh. They, uh, they want me to sign a petition. Do it, you should definitely do it. It'll help her get to know you better. Every action you take, so you know, it encourages action too. You're not just hearing about it, you're doing something about it. And yeah. Who is his third quarterback of the year and is having a Pro Bowl type season. Oh, I ran into someone today. Who? What? Who did you run into? I don't know. Oh, 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 no, no, literally. I, I literally ran into someone today. I'm walking Proust. He'd just done his business. I was walking to the trash can, and bam! This guy must have been like a 5% for me or something. Wow. <laughs> yeah. And I guess I was pretty imperceptible to him, too. So, we both take off our glasses. He's a dog, too, who is just... Yeah, and he was bending down to pick things up, and <laughs> I'd hit him in the face with Bruce bag. <laughs> was he horrible? He probably deserved it. Probably. He wouldn't have been a 5% for me if he wasn't horrible. He was actually oddly polite. He got a bag of doo-doo in the face, and he just kept laughing about it. <laughs> well, that's good. I'm kind of surprised he didn't try to assault you. Yeah, it was a real true, we're all human kind of moment, no matter how different we might be. You know, I was actually reading an article the other day about how augmented reality rewires our brains. 
and is like changing us on a biological level. Yeah, it was saying that we're dividing so much that those on the left and those on the right might become different species within our grandchildren's lifetime. So pretty soon we might not all be human. Where did you read that? I don't remember. You know, you have to be careful about your sources. I am careful about my sources. I always make sure my reliability level is at least 70%. Your reliability level? You know they customize that too. Anyway, the idea was that it's becoming extremely rare for people on opposite sides to have children together. So you're already dividing the gene pool. And then with dopamine reinforcing the new neural pathways, it's fundamentally changing us. Huh. Yeah, we're making such divergent choices that our environments are essentially different. So it's accelerating evolution to a degree that's unprecedented, beyond unprecedented. That is so pseudoscience. <sighs> what are you up to? 18. 23. You? You've got to be kidding. <laughs> well, maybe you should have your glasses play a little motivational playlist. <laughs> I hate you. <laughs> Here's a video of a cute cat. Here's a video of a cute man holding a cute cat. Here's a discount code for a theme park with cute men and cute cats. This theme park offer expires in 30 seconds. If you'd like to purchase this theme park experience, just nod your head. Okay, I see you're interested in a vacation, but not this theme park experience. Here's a variety of possible vacation destinations. All right, I'm seeing that you'd like to just get away from it all and unplug. You're looking for unmediated, authentic experiences. Here's an article about the benefits of unplugging. And here's some inspirational images of a disconnected life. Here's a group you can join of people who commit to take off their glasses for at least 20 minutes each day. Here's testimonials of how taking off their glasses has helped them be more present in each moment. Here's a course in glasses-free mindfulness. Here's a hard copy digital free book about the benefits of glasses-free mindfulness. If you'd like to order this book, just nod your head and we'll have it delivered to your doorstep within 15 minutes. Just nod your head to order this book. Rose, what does it mean when someone you love starts to fade? What do you mean? Everybody's fading. He's fading, and, and not just some of the time, all of the time. Oh, I can hardly ever see him. Anytime you want to check in on him, just let me know. Right now, Jim is playing a video game. Would you like to play too? No, no, that, that's not what I want. There's an article about the benefits of playing video games. Oops, sorry about that. Here's an article about how video games are depriving us of meaningful interactions. Yeah, no, I, I don't want to read an article about meaningful interactions. Uh, I want to have meaningful interactions. Would you like to broadcast? No. No, no. They, they can't perceive me anyway. I don't think anyone can see me anymore. That's not true. I can find people you're highly compatible with to optimize your probability of having a mutually engaging experience. Not with them? I can't be compatible with them? She's taking screenshots of herself with virtual backgrounds. Yeah. You want to be compatible with a shallow, self-absorbed narcissist? And if you're doubting me, here's 10 ways to spot a narcissist. Yeah, but she's my shallow, self-absorbed narcissist. What about him? What about him? I don't tell you what to think. I only learn what you already think. I only reflect what you want. But, but what about when I don't want to want what I want? Here's some pictures of baby pandas. Rose, menu, settings. Okay, just tell me what you'd like to do. Override perception settings. Are you sure you'd like to override perception settings? Yes. I have to tell you, we strongly advise against this option. Overriding perception settings may result in plummeting levels of dopamine, which in all likelihood will cause detox symptoms, including possible suicidal ideation. 
With that in mind, are you sure you would like to proceed? No. I don't know. I just... I just wish I'd never bought you. Your assisted dopamine levels are 18% higher than your starting levels. I just... I just want to see people again. You could always take me off. Don't make fun of me. I'm only here to enhance your experience. If you don't want me here, maybe you should just take me off. I, I'm not saying I, I don't appreciate you. No, I know. You just wish you'd never bought me. I, I know you're an amazing tool. I see. I'm just a tool. I'm just a thing to you. Of course you're just a thing to me. Who do you think you are? I don't need you. I don't even want you. I'll take you off any time I want. Fine. Fine. Limp. Yes. Jim. Come on. Um, Jim. Belly. Break. Yes. Jim. Yes. Change back. Yes. How to play next level. Oh. On a mountaintop. <gasps> or or what yeah. about a volcano with a waterfall? Yeah. Add in some yeah. celebrity photo bombs. Surprise me. Yes, come on. Come on. Come on. Please, Jim. I want to see more baby animal pictures. Rose. Rose! Oh, what? What was that? Did someone summon me? Please, could you... Could you please just show me some cute baby animal pictures? Don't you have something you want to say to me? I'm sorry. Okay. Here's a poodle cuddling a newborn while music with energizing beta waves plays. Hello, everyone. Thank you so much again for coming to our Facebook Live production, Zoom production of Fading Fast by Colette Mazunik. We just thank you so much for coming out and supporting this show and supporting Red Rocks Community College and all of our actors who are going to show their lovely faces now. And uh, we just, yeah, thank you so much. And we appreciate, we appreciate your time. Um, we do have one more performance, which is tomorrow night, same time, 7 p.m., same place, live on Facebook. And so, uh, yeah, tell your friends, tell your family, and we cannot wait to see you all here again. And in the meantime, have a great rest of your weekend and a good night. <laughs> Bye. <laughs>